All right, guys, I'm going to do a video on how to uh, pump snakes that are reluctant rodent feeders. Uh, first of all, you need this syringe. It's a, uh, um, you can just type it on Amazon, uh, type in baby bird syringe feeder, and it'll come up. Uh, it comes with uh, three little tubes. Um, these two and this one. I always use this one for all my snakes. The other ones are like too flimsy and stuff. Uh, anyway, you, you, I use uh, chicken Gerber food, um, but you can also use, I believe, beef. Some people use beef. I like chicken, it works great for me. So uh, anyway, I already opened it up and I've mixed it to make sure it's nice and uh, mixed. And then what you do is you suck it up I like to feed them what I would consider to be around a pinky size so right around there right around there it's like a pinky's worth anyway then I clean this up so just clean it up real good Okay, then I put the top on all the way on. Also, I have a little Ziploc bag that I sprayed some spam, some Pam, sorry, not spam, <laughs> some Pam in there. So what I do is I open it up and I soak the tip so it slides into the snake's mouth. All right, so I'm gonna move this out of the way. Put it right here. I'm gonna get my baby snake. Back up a little bit. This is my baby Alterna. And as you can see, I've been feeding her. I've been maybe five, six times I've pumped her. She's growing quite a bit and she's nice and chunky, so it works really good. Anyway, you gotta hold them behind the head. And what I do is I introduce the syringe, I mean the tube. You gotta work with them, there you go. Oh, try it again. That's why the PAM works great. Okay, now I go all the way in. Then I pump, and as I pump, I go back slowly, slowly, all the way. And sometimes that happens. That's why we have paper towel. And that's it. That's how you do it.